Fast, accurate, and every day. First Defense Weather. Well, a happy Friday to you, and boy, it's a soggy one out there. The chance of rain over the next five days here. Today, we've got basically almost a 100% chance of rain, about a 95% chance that's widespread rain, but it will be tapering off through the day west to east. Now, over the weekend, we do bring in a few rain showers, but understand, neither weekend day is going to be a total washout, and especially Mother's Day, not a total washout. That's the good news here. And then by the time we head into next week, we actually see some mainly dry days heading our way for early next week. Now, something you might have seen uh, on social media or online is a new uh, rocket launch that NASA will be conducting down in Virginia at uh, the uh, Wallops, uh, the uh, Wallops uh, Space Flight Center down there where they uh, launch rockets in uh, Virginia. And uh, there is a chance we could see some of the trail smoke from the rocket launch Saturday night. So uh, here's kind of a graphic that we made that kind of uh, shows you the time of when you can at least see some of the smoke. So obviously right near the launch site, zero to 30 seconds after launch, you'll be able to see it up in the sky. Across Western New York and Northwestern Pennsylvania, possibly about 30 to 60 seconds after launch. And then once you work further to, to the uh, west, about 60 to 90 seconds further out towards Detroit. And then by the time you get to around Chicago, about 90 to 120 seconds. But all of this is gonna be dependent on cloud cover. Again, I'm not guaranteeing we're going to be able to see this, but we are hopeful we could at least get a little bit of clearing across the southern tier to at least see a little bit of the smoke uh, from the or the tailwind uh, from the uh, rocket launch tomorrow night. So here's future scan shows you the widespread rain tapering off from west to east through the day. And then after that actually moves on out of here, the majority of the afternoon should be mainly dry. We may see a few breaks in the cloud cover through the afternoon, but don't expect full on sunshine. But you may see a few peekaboo pieces of sun uh, later in the afternoon. Now tomorrow, basically same story, scattered rain showers through the day, but it's not going to be all day rain and notice the scattered nature. And then by the time we head into Saturday night, we're hopeful we can get enough clearing where we can see some of the tailwind of the rocket launch down in Virginia. But don't be emailing me or writing in or calling saying it's cloudy. You say, no, I'm saying we're hopeful. I'm not guaranteeing we're going to see it. I'm, we're going to remain on the hopeful side that hopefully we can get some clearing in Saturday night to be able to see that. And that's at 802, by the way, that's when they schedule to uh, shoot the rocket off. So 42 to 48 to through the day today, a widespread difference from where we were yesterday. Widespread rain. Some of it could be soaking at times by, uh, especially as it moves west to east with a northwest wind 7 to 14 miles per hour. Tonight, mostly cloudy, scattered rain showers at times. We may mix in a few wet snowflakes on the highest hills, not a guarantee, but especially on the highest hills in the valley locations where you flirt with the freezing temperature. So you may see at least a wet snowflake at times there. 33 to 40 with a southwest wind 5 to 10 miles per hour. Now uh, tomorrow, 49 degrees, more rain showers through the day. Now neither weekend day is not a total washout, and especially Mother's Day. 51 degrees here, but rain showers at times not all day rain, 52 on uh, Monday, partly sunny. And then we actually see the return of some sunshine, both Tuesday and Wednesday. Temperatures going up into the lower 60s by the time we head into Thursday with a small chance for at least a scattered or isolated rain shower.